should you train in Ramadan? If so, when you should train and how you should train. Hi everyone and welcome to a new video. Welcome to MHC World of Fitness. Ramadan Mubarak to all of you. Today is a sunny day as you can see and I am outside. I'm gonna hit a nice workout session in Ramadan. I'm fasting right now. It's actually 6.25 p.m. and I still have two hours until fast breaking. So we're gonna have a nice and clean workout here as you can see outside because as you all know it's the lockdown for the third, fourth, fifth time and the gyms are closed so that's why we're gonna train today outside I've already prepared everything as you can see I will show you in a second so as you can see guys this is everything I need for today's workout here I'm gonna practice my deadlift my bench uh, press and of course my squats I need a bench of course for my bench press and some weights this is all I have this is all I need and this is also all you need if you want to train at home or in your garden it's gonna be maybe five exercises for our main muscles of course our chest our legs and maybe shoulders and back stay tuned at the end of this video because in this video I want to share with you something really really important and it is the important question in Ramadan when or should we train in Ramadan so guys the first exercise will be squats we're gonna hit our legs so stay tuned fasting it's better not to hit a lot of cardio because it's not good for you you are not drinking a lot of water and you are not eating the whole day so so that's why I'm starting straight to the main muscles or to the main exercises so that I can hit my main muscle without losing a lot of energy that's why because now my body has a limited amount of energy that's why I should consume this energy wisely so that's why I'm gonna hit all my main muscles work exercises and then if I still have some energy left maybe I can do some type of cardio so let's start our second set let's go just like that second set is done so we are now in the month of Ramadan and I saw in YouTube a lot of influencers or youtubers who are um, giving you advices if you or should you train in Ramadan while fasting or after you break your fasting so it's I will I will be honest with you I've trained my whole life in Ramadan before break, uh, fast breaking. So I trained while fasting. Why? Because I want to get my body to the limits. So with the limit, I mean endurance, of course, and resistance. So if you want to have a body, a strong body, where you, just like my other video, where I talk about do you want to look strong or do you want to be strong? This is the type of workout that they will help you to get stronger without. Maybe you, you will look strong, but, but it's not a necessity. So if you want to have a body, a strong body, so do it my way if you want to. But to answer this question, I'm gonna let you enjoy first the second or the third set of my workout and then we're gonna talk later so stay tuned
Very good. And just like that, first exercise is done. Now we're gonna get to the second. Stay tuned. Next, guys, are we gonna get to the second exercise? It's gonna be some deadlifts for our hamstrings. So stay tuned for it. training while fasting is because this this guys as a natural athlete 100 natural athlete someone who is doing a lot of um, bodybuilding or fitness naturally 100 it's really difficult to lose this body fat so that's why i'm doing it right now at ramadan because i know while fasting your body needs energy best way to get loss or to get loose from this fat or body fat is working out while fasting i'm not ashamed to have this type of body fat as you can see because now i am sure i have less body fat than i did have two months ago or two months before so that's why i'm really proud of my results that's how my body is looking right now as you can see and it's just the beginning that's why i highly recommend you to train to be disciplined all you need is your body all you need is your dedication or you're willing to train nothing else you don't need any supplements you don't need any post workouts or pre-workouts uh, proteins you need only your dedication some materials or only your body and, it, and you're gonna be fine so that's why a lot of you are watching my videos and thinking what what this fat young man is trying to tell us yes i am fat a little bit but i can hit 190 kilos deadlifts if you want to see that go check out my instagram why i'm telling you all of this you don't need to look strong to be strong you can be strong without looking strong and this is the important thing my journey has just begun and i have a lot a long way to go that's why i'm doing all the all the hard work and i'm pull, pulling all my efforts in ramadan also to get strong every day and of course feeling good and don't forget at the end of this video i'm gonna tell you gonna reveal the answer for the famous question when and should you or should you train while fasting in ramadan deadlifts are done so now we're gonna get to the third and the final exercise for our legs it's gonna be the sumo deadlift and then we're gonna get to our upper body i think i'm gonna hit three exercises first exercise will be shoulder press second is barbell back rows and the third is of course bench press so i'm think i think i'm gonna get four sets each so that i can maximize my pump of course as i said i'm working out while fasting so that's why i should be careful how to use or to consume my energy but at the meanwhile i should maximize my pump so that's why we're gonna do we're gonna hit four sets each exercise but before that let's hit some sumo squats let's go
thing I need to tell all of you is don't try to copy everything something someone else is doing in his life. So if you want to train and if you want to work out, do it your way. Do it the way you want to, you enjoy it or you have fun doing it. That's why I'm doing all of this, not because I'm, I'm copying someone else. No, because it's make me, it makes me happy. It's make me force the man I am or the man I am today. And it makes my body stronger. Try to use or try to choose wisely. What are you doing in your life? It is, it's your time, it's your life. And it's of course your body. So be smart and enjoy the process. Third set, let's go. Third set is done, legs are done, they are looking good, they are looking strong, I'm feeling good, I'm feeling strong, let's get to our upper body and start with our shoulders. The exercise we're going to do today is barbell shoulder press, so let's get into it. press done two more to go so let's hit our back with the best exercise for my case right now is the barbell back rows so without any introductions let's start so before we continue guys I need to ask you for one favor if you want to support the channel of course if you support the channel you are supporting me and the work and of course the dedication it's the most important thing please don't forget to hit the like button if you like this exercise and turn on the notification bell that will help me of course with the algorithm and of course give me some feedback at the comment session are you the type to train while fasting or after fast breaking let me know what do you think of training in Ramadan or are you training in Ramadan or not? This type of comments make me or give me an idea what type of people are watching my channel and of course your interest so that it can so that I can make videos to fulfill your interests. And if you have any questions, what type of workout you need in Ramadan, uh, what type of exercises are better or not, I will leave my Instagram page at the description down below. You can hit me there, you can ask me any question you want. If you want to follow me, I will leave, I will leave my Instagram down below. And now, let's continue our workout. As I told you, we're gonna hit the barbell back rows. So, let's go. Let's continue with our last exercise, the bench press. Let's go.
do you have your answer yet? Yes, of course. If I can train while fasting, you can do it also. I'm not saying it's gonna be easy for you at the beginning, no. But if you start with a half an hour before fast breaking, you can do a half an hour workout. Of course, any one of us can do it. If you want so, and of course, if you have the motivation to do so. So that's why, as you can see, I've trained now maybe an hour or an hour and a half. Working out while filming is not the same as working out without filming. So that's why today it's a special day because I'm filming and at the same time I'm working out. But in the normal day you can work you can work out only for 30 or 45 minutes maximum one hour. That's it for your fast breaking. It is possible. Don't let anyone tell you it's not. Don't let anyone tell you you need this, you need that, your body is weak or something like this. No, our body is really strong. We have a lot of energy, we have a lot of power. We can use it wisely, of course. So that's why this is your answer. Should you train in Ramadan and when you can train in Ramadan? Of course, my answer, my personal answer is you can train in Ramadan and of course before fast breaking. This is it for me. I am feeling good. Now in a half an hour or 45 minutes, I will go home, I will take a shower and I will enjoy my food. So that's why do the same, stay strong. And of course, let's hit our last set and I will see you in a second. That's it guys I hope you enjoyed this video I'm really hungry right now <laughs> I feel the impact of this workout as you can see I have a nice pump just in one hour of course so if I can do it you can do the same you can have a nice workout before the fast breaking I wish all of you a happy Ramadan and of course I'm gonna see you in the next video but before please do me a favor just hit the like button subscribe if you are not and of course turn on the post notification bell so that you can so that you will never miss a new video and of course that will help me with the algorithm of youtube so please don't forget and of course share this video with your friends that have the same issue that don't have this the answer of this question should you or when you can train in ramadan so please don't forget and of course everyone enjoy your iftar eat healthy don't eat a lot be smart and enjoy the process and of course i will see you in the next video peace